Assalamu alaikum. Mr. Moderator, our distinguished guests, brothers and sisters, our friends and, and our enemies. I ran into one of the guys who used to go there. And he, he was like, man, uh, I was like, yeah, man, I really enjoyed working there, man. I was, I was, I was hurt. He said, yeah, man, it, it, from what it seems, you know, to, to, to us, it was because you were diverting the, the, the attention away from the individual. Mm -hmm. Yes. Welcome to the wonderful world of Dow. <laughs> yeah. So, I mean, now that's, and that's not even Dow. You were actually teaching them some skills, you know, like, right. you were, you know, right. there were some important skills that you need yeah. to learn to get into the books of, you know, Islam, whatever you're learning, Arabic, or whatnot, you know, Ajikul Mia, yeah. you know, yeah. these Because this is the key, this is the key to the, to the Dean, you know, Al-Luga, Al-Mifta, Al-Ilm. Nah, yes, of course, the, the language is the key to knowledge. To the, to the knowledge, yeah. Yeah, of course, if you don't understand the language, how are you going to get it, right? Yeah. You know, so, you know, Again, you know, this, this, these type of things are so common yes. with Black people. So common with Black people. Yes. Right? And yeah, you're going to hear these stories, you know, on the, on the features, right? You're going to hear these stories because these stories are important. They are. You know? And so, anyway, continue. <laughs> so, you know, I mean, I, I just... It um, when when I was told that I, I was, it, it it, I didn't understand, man. I, I really because I did not want to think that this is how it was. You know mm -hmm. that this is that this is how it was. Um, you know, alhamdulillah. Uh, I can remember also a time when I had, <laughs> I had fell. You, you know, I I was, I for some reason, I, I think I didn't have a job at the time or whatever, you know, mm -hmm. but I had worked for the, um, the, the community, uh, the community uh, 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 mortician, mm -hmm. the, the, the community uh, funeral home. Mm -hmm. I worked there for about a year or so. Mm -hmm. I learned a lot of skills, man. You know, so everybody in the community, they, they knew who I was. Mm -hmm. they, they, they knew who I was. They know I just wasn't one of those type of people fly by night. I'm in there. Then I try to beg and do you know do this because it happens. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It, it, it does happen. And I do understand that. Mm -hmm. and, but I had set a precedent, mm -hmm. you, you know, that, 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 you know, I, that was not my, that, that's not what I did. Yeah. You, you know, so <clears throat> what happened is I, I went to, I had fell on hard times. I went and asked the community, could they help me? Uh, I needed help with the rent at the time. Mm -hmm. um, and I still, I kept this letter. Mm -hmm. It's from the masjid at I-A-N-T. Now this is a masjid that, that was bringing in millions of dollars. Mm -hmm. Millions, mm -hmm. millions. I mean, they were bringing, they were bringing in millions of dollars. And um, when, People of other ethnicities, because I've seen it. Yeah. I, I got a chance to see and compare the, ch the checks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When people of, of other ethnicity were going in there and, 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 and with the same problems. Yeah. They were, they were, they were given a lot more. So, I mean. And, and what, what was the demographic of that message? The, the, it was mainly Pakistanis. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It was Pakistanis. You had... Uh, uh, some Bangladeshis and things of this nature, but I, I think for the most part, it was Pakistanis, Pakistanian people, and Indian people. Yeah, yeah. So, so mm -hmm. um, you, and this was my first time I had uh, asked the, this 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 the masjid uh, Richardson. It's called the Richardson Masjid for anything. They gave me fifty dollars. Mashallah. I would be loving this shit. Mashallah. Bro. <laughs> I mean, and, and I was like, are, are, are they serious? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You, you know, but like, like I said, I was not the one that was Is always it? there, you know, I, I begging, you know, yeah. I drove, I actually drove bus in Dallas. 
And mm-hmm. I think I was going between the transitional period of working for the funeral home and mm-hmm. then working for the, uh, the bus going for the, to the bus company. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And and between that transitional period, I needed help with the rent. And yeah, that I, was it, it. I was like fifty dollars. Yeah. Even the the funeral director at the time, his name is Kazi. He was mm-hmm. like, "What in the world?" He said, "Man, I can't believe that." And mm-hmm. I think he actually, you know. Uh, help me out, you know what I'm saying? So not you. I don't put everybody in the same bag right, as, yeah. as being, you know, make blank making blanket statements. Mm-hmm. But I know the institution. Yep. The leaders, the leaders of the institutions. Mm-hmm. You yep. know, the malat of the yes. institutions. They, the leaders. Yep. They, um, they. De- there's something going on with the way the the process. Mm-hmm. that they use to to demarcate or to give the money you know what you what they what people call today masajid and mosque and whatever they're not mosque or masajid they're cultural centers call them what they are yes call them what they are they're cultural centers yes. which is why we're brothers when we're donating money to your cultural center but we're not brothers when we ask for something back from you yes yes you know yeah, I, I, I tell you this is the 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 ISGH, the Islamic Society of Greater Houston Cultural Center, mm. they actually told an African American brother one time uh, mm. who was asking for some funds. He needed help, mm. and this happens, you know, mm. because yeah. the vast majority of people who go there to ask for funds are Pakistani people or Indian people. Yeah. Um, the people who use the funds are the people who are in administration. Mm-hmm. Now, the people in 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 in, in Plano, they, in, in uh, Richardson, there was a big fight about where m- the monies were misappropriated. Misappropriated. Yeah. People were buying uh, 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 townhomes, mm-hmm. building whole townhomes, and selling them, making money. Um, they, they, this is basically money laundering. Yeah, taking the the m- money from the donations, making a business out of it, buying doing a venture with it, and mm-hmm. then hoping to siphon some money back in. Mm-hmm. Yep, that you had taken out. So this goes on all the time. Mm-hmm. But anyway, ISGH in particular, they told the, a, a a a a few African American people that w- were asking and they were in need that I know they said. We are a business. We're not wow. a religious institution. Mashallah, mashallah. And what have I been telling y'all? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they I, just I mean, did it bluntly like that. He he what let it. He has, let it out I'm that I've been telling y'all for a latter part of my year. <laughs> He let the cat out the bag, brother. Yep, yes, he did. Without any, without any hesitation. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, you know yes. that was that was that was that. Now was, you know why your met your local massage are asking you for money every single week. Okay. Yeah. yeah. You know why? You know what I'm saying? Especially the black ones. Especially the black ones. Yeah. I mean, there's there's some in the in the hood or whatever. Local communities, whatever they they actually they're actually communities, and they're trying to build something. Those ones need to be supported. Absolutely, they need Absolutely. to be supported. But you got a mosque for like twenty years in the hood, and you're still after twenty years asking for donations for the masjid. After twenty years, you don't own the masjid, you don't own the building. Why are you asking the people? By after twenty years, you should be owning that building. Like what's what is going on there? What's going on? You understand? That's a problem. That's a problem because the message not uh, today are churches. There's a say, well, it's the same thing we're doing in the churches. You know, when grandma, you know, used to give give all her life savings to the church or whatnot. What's what's the difference? Yeah. What and it's it is bad, you know, because I try to find out when that transition, when did that transition actually happen? Because at one time, when I when I when initially came into it. I don't know if they were like that. Maybe I was just too uh, uh, naive, my naivete. I yeah. didn't see it. Maybe yeah. it was like that, mm-hmm. you know, but I- I'm not but, sure. You know, there is there's always a, a naivete with uh, new Muslims that always be there. Right. 
Absolutely. So what we do, right, is we tell the new Muslims, look, don't you ever think for a second, right, that people call that everybody who's calling your not everybody brother who calls you brother is your brother. Yes. We tell you straight up, right? If you want to follow Islam, right? You look into the Quran, you look into the Sunnah, you look how the Sahaba understood it, right? If you want to get Islamic knowledge, you you go to the the ulama, the real scholars, right? Uh, especially the ones who passed away, because you know what they died upon. Yes. Right, especially those ones. But if you think you're going to go to your local master to get help from them, especially these cultural centers, call them what they are. Don't call them misad. You call them cultural centers. You know, because you set up all these cultural centers, that's why your children now are having problems sticking to Islam. Because you did not participate or include the black convert who knows everything about the society. You, you decided to exclude us. Well, congratulations, <laughs> right? Yeah. How's that looking for you now? <laughs> you know what I mean? You have all these articles about, you know, your kids leaving Islam, all these, uh, uh, you know, uh, second generation Muslims on, on uh, TikTok talking about I'm a queer Muslim and whatever my queer identity, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Converts don't do that, <laughs> you know. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> but yo, that's that's your fault, your fault, yeah. and that's why I say that we don't play the, these brotherhood games anymore. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Those days are over. They're they have to be. They have to be over. Yeah. You know what I mean, sorry it's to cut you off, but continue. <laughs> so, so um, you know, just just really experiencing that. And, and there were been there there have been numerous and I do mean numerous uh, uh, situations that I've been you know that I've been an eyewitness of where <laughs> the African American brothers would be negatively treated at, uh, uh, Ramadan mm -hmm. as far as passing out of the food mm -hmm. you know being skipped in line. Uh, and, 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 it, and it turned, and a lot of times it would turn into a fiasco. I remember uh, several times having to break brothers up to, you know, tell people, man, what, you know, what, what's going on? Why, why can't I have this? You're giving it to them. Why can't I have some of yeah. And, and, and uh, you know, or people just throwing their plates down, you know. Um, but that may be a, more of a cultural thing. You know, I get, it may be a cultural thing to just mm. kind of toss the plate down yeah. and move on to the next one, toss it down again, move on yeah. to. But this is not what people, uh, the 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 population here is used to. Yeah. So you 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 may have to modify that action in order to be in line with what the local population is uh, is is is. Um, was on, you know, just to, if it'll avoid any, if it avo will av help avoid chaos, mm. why not? Mm -hmm. You know, so I, I've been privy to that where, where um, that was done to people, you know, mm. African-American people felt slighted yep. in, in those, in those times. Um, um, you know, so there's been, there's been a lot of things that have transpired in my, uh, two and a half decade uh, journey as a Muslim. Mm -hmm. uh, but one thing that I've, I've um, did, you know, and, and, and this is something that kind of uh, I learned as a bus driver. Uh, I used to drive the, at these, on these park and ride buses, these big, nice buses. Mm -hmm. And they would take the people from the suburbs directly downtown to the high rises where they worked. Mm -hmm. So when I first started working for uh, this particular route, I would say good morning to everybody. Good morning, good morning. Mm -hmm. They would get on the bus, you know, kind of with a mean scowl on their face and they would just go on and oh, yeah. put their money in. <laughs> Don't even say anything. Yeah. <laughs> so then what happened is that uh, I, I got upset. I, I got upset. So I stopped saying good morning. Mm -hmm. Now, after a couple of days, it started to hurt for me to see people. I didn't feel right seeing people come on the bus mm. and me not say 
Good, good morning. morning. Yeah, yeah. So I said to myself, I came to the conclusion, mm. this is for me, not for them. Mm. I'm going to do what I'm supposed to do. And it's up to them to do what they're supposed to do. Mm. But I'm going to do, because it, it, without, when I didn't do that, I didn't feel right. Yeah. So how, what, how, whether they, res, whether they responded or not to me, I said, it's okay. Responsibility. That's on them. Yeah. I'm still going to say, Hey, good morning. You know, I'm still smile. So I, I, the point is, is that I had to look at Islam exactly like that. Mm. I couldn't allow the, the way that the, the, the people who were in charge of Islam, how they would treat the the african americans yeah you know how they would treat uh the the minorities how i would see them you know they would have the spanish people working in their in their, their liquor stores and in their 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 liquor filled gas stations and they would they would have and how they would do it i mean i know i've heard stories mm. i've heard stories from uh, individuals who used to, who, who were part of the organization Islam in Spanish, I've heard stories from them about how the how those people the 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 the, the immigrant Muslims treated them while they were working at their stores, the Indian the Indians and the Pakistanis and things of that nature. How they would uh, uh, how they would treat them with disdain, mm -hmm. like their slave. You know, some of them would even be physically abused. Mm -hmm. hit and things of this nature mm -hmm. so i've had this conversation with some some Span hispanic people hispanic muslims mm -hmm. and um but 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 in it all i i learned how to say that this is not indicative of the dean mm -hmm. this this has the, their their cultural uh uh, uh more, their cultural their, their cultural uh uh habit habits yeah their cultural thinking has nothing to do with islam that is outside of islam especially yeah. things like that yes you know and we have to know, we have to make islam that, has a uh, thing it we says have to make that very islam. very clear we have to make that crystal clear yeah you understand so that yeah. people when they hear us you know speaking about these things we make a very plain blunt distinction and we say, hmm. what you guys are doing, that is not from Islam, period. And, you, and no, amount of, no amount of excuses you make will ever make it from Islam. And you getting mad at us is even worse. Right. It's even worse because you do it and you get mad at us, yes. at us for exposing it. Right? So you do something that's against Islam. Yeah. And instead of stopping what you're doing, you're trying to stop the people who are telling you to stop what you're doing. So you can continue doing a thing that is against Islam. Yes. You understand? Yes. Yes. So continue, bro. Sorry. <laughs> so, 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 no, no. <laughs> no so I, 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 what I, what I kind of, kind of uh, concentrated on in, in, in there's an ayat in the Quran. Mm -hmm. It says, uh, mm -hmm. yeah, that's better. You know, and, and I just kind of, just concentrated on on that I, that started to become my main mm -hmm. uh, uh point of focus to mm -hmm. to hold on to to the rope of a lot you know to learn as much as i and 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 just yeah, you know don't be uh split or divided it, exactly but now i did i was very blunt mm -hmm. with these with the perpetrators of this this type of behavior I was very blunt with them that uh, if you, you know, I mean, to the point where I would say to some, if you come at me with that, we're going to have problems. Yeah. So you're going to handle, we're going we gonna to talk to each other like men. Mm -hmm. You know, we're going to deal with this in a, in a, in a nice and, and friendly Muslim manner, yeah. because if we don't, there's going to be problems. Yeah. So this, uh, me taking that type of attitude, it, 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 um, it cut a lot of the nonsense off at the pass, mm -hmm. you know, so, uh, but, you know, we know that it's, it's always there in, in it, it, it's there. Yeah. This is, you know, people who try to, we can't sweep it underneath the rug. And not anymore anyways. Yeah, it exists. Not anymore. Not anymore. It exists. Not anymore. It exists. It's not, it's not, it's not something that is, is uh, no isolated incidents. No, this is widespread. 
Yes. This is absolutely. this is the norm. It's not the it's not the exception to the rule. It is the rule. Right. 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 And all this sweeping it under the rug and oh, I'm not racist and no, I don't think of no, it's just some people not. We don't do that anymore. <laughs> yeah. We don't do that anymore. Right. It's not right. no some people. You know it's not no some people. Yeah. You know what I mean? You know it's not just a few bad apples. You know that. Right. You know what I mean? Right. Right. <laughs> yeah. And so, you know, like you say, like a lot of times what you say, you know, it, it's about, you know, the people, it's about the, the people who are disenfranchised. Yep. I mean, we can't. How, you, how, you, how do you treat the people who were brought here as chattel, right, from mm -hmm. Kufar, you know, you treat them worse than the Kufar who brought them here as chattel to begin with. Yes. You understand? And these are the people who are becoming Muslim. Right, right. So you should, brotherhood entails that you teach them, you know, Islam and, and give them manners and these type of things, right? But you, that, it doesn't happen. It doesn't, I mean, when I became Muslim back in those days, you know, because like I said, there, there wasn't this type of cultural, because there really, there weren't really that many uh immigrant communities back back in those days you just really like, yeah yeah it was like i, I thought toronto always had a big it was multicultural yes it was always multicultural right uh -huh. but um like but it, it was like you know it, you know i was born in 1975 right so my my most of my life i kind of seen like white people you know what i mean okay like, you okay. know so in 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 toronto it was like Mostly, like when I went to school, it was um, mostly Italians and Portuguese because I went to Catholic school and okay. I dealt with like some heavy, heavy, heavy racism, you know? Like some, I can imagine. Some, some hard, especially from those Italian kids, bro. What? Wow. <laughs> you know, yeah. I used to get bullied, bro. Yeah. <laughs> I used yeah. to get bullied. But you, anyway, you were, they, they, I know, you know, you were accustomed to the word mooly or something. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> I do oh some attacks. Gosh, they used to call me. Since we met you people 500 years ago, look at us. We've given everything. You are still taking. It's true. I mean, where will the whole Western world be without be without Africa? Our cocoa, our timber, our gold, our diamonds, our platinum, our whatever. Everything you are. It's us. I am not saying it. It's a fact. And and in in return for all of this, what have we got? Nothing. Anti-personnel indoctrination against ourselves. If you go and cook your horrible diseases like AIDS, you say it is us. You brought us tuberculosis. We didn't have this big cough until white people came here in exchange for in exchange for africa giving europe 500 solid years of our people i mean not europe the western world of our human beings to work your canes to dig your gold to take in gold itself diam i mean you know fish peanuts palm oil everything in exchange for that, we have got nothing, nothing, and you know it, nothing. And you look upon, you know, so white folks look upon us like monkeys. It is true. It's in your literature. Hey, you know, some of your best thinkers have said this about us. Have you heard of the, I mean, all these Germans, have you heard? Okay. Yes, they said Lord Burton, people like that. They said we 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 don't even have the brain of of animals. That's what we've got from you people. But don't you think that this is over now? Over where? Is it over? Who said that eight came from the green monkey? 